guys, welcome back to SourceFed Nerd. I'm Trisha Hirschberger, and today, XI3 tried to take the cake for the first available Steam box. And it is. Kind of. Basically, XI3's piston, which we saw at CES, you can click here for that video, has an availability date of November 29th, 2013. Yes, that is Black Friday this year. Pre-orders will even ship two weeks earlier. The specs are even more awesome now than they were before, with double the storage and an optimized for gameplay traffic ethernet controller. Now, the second SSD connector announced today on piston makes it possible to load a second operating system. Say, for example, SteamOS. So this comes right on the heels of three big announcements from Valve last week. First, SteamOS, a new badass operating system designed for, quote, gaming, for the living room, and for Steam. Things like killer specs, family sharing of games on multiple Steam accounts, and access to music, TV, and movies, plus, you know, customization, are the main advantages touted by Valve. The second announcement is that there will be many hardware options available beginning in 2014 from different manufacturers, like XI3 and Piston. So they're beating the 2014 date, that's for sure. But is it really a Steam box? Valve has its own prototype Steam boxes that will be shipped out to 300 lucky beta testers. You can register to be considered for a beta tester through your Steam account, like I already have. Then never mind, nix that. Don't register, because then you're lessening my chances. The third announcement is the Steam controller, which is freaking weird, but I'm intrigued. It's designed to work with all Steam games, even games without controller support. There are no joysticks. Yeah. You heard me. But instead, two haptic feedback track pads, a touch screen in the center, and some unusual button placement choices. Now, translating keyboard mouse games to controller will be a group project of sorts with custom configurations being shareable amongst players. And of course, everything Valve is doing with the Steam Box, the controller, the OS, is hackable slash customizable, letting you, the player, be the creator to make the best possible gaming experience ever. And that's at least the theory. I'm into it. So how do you feel about the idea of a Steam-centered console? Do you think it will be compatible? with the PS4 or the Xbox One and other consoles that are out there. Let us know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. You can click this annotation or go to sourcefed.com, see all our typed out stuff. My name's Trisha Hirschberger and I don't know that I'm comfortable giving up my directional keys just yet, but I do love that this is happening. I mean, I could still use my keyboard and mouse. I could plug it into, you know, Piston or whatever other box if I wanted to, but those controllers are just so weird and I want them.